All right, for our next presentation, may I call on stage uh, Mr. Gaurav Soni, CEO, Infinia Retail on stage, please. Can we give a big round of applause for Mr. Soni here? Hi, can you hear me? Good. Yeah, so... I'll, I have this question in my mind since six months, which I'm trying to answer for myself and for my customers, right? Why customers buy from you? Now, in general, when you speak or somebody, you know, talks to you, generally you've seen the behavior of an individual that he says, okay, what do you do? You know, how you do it, right? That's something which is very difficult to answer, right? And that's, that's the challenge that if we know why customers buy from us, what is the reason, right? why he is coming, what, what, is, what is making that customer to come to me, right? Is it my product? Is it my service? Is it the discounts that I'm giving to him? Is it the loyalty? So these are all manipulations that we do to attract the customer or bring the customer to our store to do a transaction with us. Is the customer loyal with us? We don't know. Generally, uh, the trend has been seen that a customer decides to buy a product or a service not uh, with the rational data. So 30% of the data confuses the customer. Generally, the decisions that happens in your life, uh, you know, happens from your irrational mind. And that's really important that as a retailer or as a business, do we really know why our customers are with us? So quickly, I'll introduce myself. My name is Gaurav Soni. I'm the uh, co-founder and director of Lean Apps. We started a journey uh, three years back. We are in Berlin and we have started uh, in India and we are now in Noida and Pune with 55 team members. Uh, you can connect me on LinkedIn at uh, Gaurav Soni 79. This is a very, uh, so I am really impressed and uh, you know, when, when I read Steve Jobs' uh, quotes. Now this clearly indicates that technology is something which is an enabler for you, right? Even if you don't have a technology, but if you have a good experience to the customer, yeah, the customer becomes loyal to you for your whole lifetime in your business cycle. I will give you a very short story of uh, my uh, recent uh, experience when I was uh, planning to buy a Bluetooth uh, uh, speaker. Uh, and my, my expectation was to actually have a good bass. I, I'm a fan of uh, listening to rock and uh, house music. And when I went to the store, uh, the guy, you know, I, I looked at the product and I didn't know anything about the product. I didn't care about the features. I, it somehow looked really good to me. I went to the store I, and it was a Bose product, really very costly. Uh, you know, I was not able to afford it. So, and this guy, you know, he just bombarded me with, you know, all the features, functionalities, that this is the amazing product that you can go for. You know, the best features, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Now, I gathered all the information, came back, uh, did my research online, and I found a product which was one for the price, Marshall, and the reviews were amazing. And then I went back to the store, and I said, okay, let me now have a touch and feel of the product, because the cost of the product was, I think, around 20, 25,000. So I still wanted to go as a user to see and feel it, right? Went to the store, saw the product, and eventually went to Amazon to buy it, just because of the price, because of the lower price that I got. It was almost half the price of, uh, uh, you know, what that guy was offering. Now, that's the challenge that if you see, uh, you see every day with your sales reps. Do they ask you right questions when you are uh, doing your sales on the floor? Are they putting the right questions? He could have asked me about my budget. He could have asked me about uh, some other questions which could have qualified me as a customer when I was standing in the store. And actually, uh, at that, I wanted to buy at that point of time, that moment, moment, right? And that's something which he could not catch at that point of time. So it's actually about experience, and that's what I mentioned that, you know, generally, your shopping experience, uh, your decision actually happens before you walk into the store. And what, what are we doing as a retailer to actually change or gauge that decision for that customer? As a customer, what do I want? So, you know, uh, today we're talking about omni-channel, we're talking about customer experience. Eventually what is important is the customer wants uh, a seamless experience. If I have, if I go back, uh, you know, in my customer journey, even buying my product, I looked at, uh, you know, the reviews. I didn't know anyone who were actually putting the reviews there. We don't know, right? They're all uh, reviews put by uh, people whether we don't get the names. But we still buy that reviews, go and change our decisions based on the reviews, right? So it's very important, you know, that as a customer, we really understand the psyche of the customer. So in, in our journey, we have actually went to the customers, spoken to the customers, understood their pain points, and this is what we realize that a customer today wants easiness. They want to order online, receive at home. They want to order in store, they receive at home. They want to, you know, they want, to, they want something where they say, okay, I want to order online, 
I, I don't want to actually, I want, I'm a lazy customer, right? I don't want to go back, uh, spend my time for two hours, you know, going through stuff. Rather, I'll actually buy and, and not click, you know, the product should be available at my home. What I don't want to do is, I hate, I, a lot of times when I go and uh, do my shopping on Zara, uh, particularly in the uh, you know, sales uh, season, and it's a challenge for me, I was actually crying, I was dying when Zara will come with their app, so that I can place the order, the products come at my place, and it's very easy, uh, sir? Yeah, yeah, uh, oh, quickly run. So I'll quickly run through the slide. So, uh, yeah. So uh, what we have identified is what is our why? Why are we in the business? And we have identified that we, you know, we deliver the unmatched customer experience. That is what we want to focus on. Our products that we are working on are user friendly and very beautifully designed. And we have some products which are which you can see here. That's what we are focusing on uh, in in our what journey. So this is quickly about the sales associate app. So we have built this app for the sales associates to engage the customer in the store when he's there. And this helps them to know the customer well, create a lead. A lead is created, it can be pushed to an online platform and the customer can go and convert that lead back into sales by the online platform, right? It could also help uh, you know, the guys to do the self-checkout, which could be very quick. This is the customer app, which could be uh, your white label app. Uh, you can discover products online and offline. Uh, you can chat with the sales associate in the store. Uh, your customer can also do self-chat directly in the store or he can buy online. This is a, a quick digital transformation uh, you know, uh, poster that we have put in, which actually uh, tells you the, your customer journey or your uh, digital journey across uh, the digital transformation platform. That's it from my side. Uh, don't forget to collect this uh, copy. It's free for, for, uh, that we are available in store. So it's, we're on H9. Uh, we're most welcome to come there, and you will be happy to you know, guide you through the process. Thank you.